Welcome to Overpowered. I'm Joven X. And this is David. TV. And, um. Big D. Yeah, we were talking about. Oh, yeah, the Lady. girl that I dated at one time. Uh. She. It was. It was a ride, but they were like. Just stone all the time. And. Uh. So it was like weird. Like and puss. Like, to be honest, it felt very much like. <laughs> what the hell are you? Like. Like she was very into her girlfriend, but she also wanted some D. Yeah. And I was like. Yeah, this doesn't feel like an actual, real, like, something I want to pursue. <laughs> like, I was trying to be open-minded about it, but I was like, yeah, I don't think I can. What was she, was she mean to you or something? She no, it's me? just a whole what relationship the heck? thing. Oh, yeah. yeah, I don't know what's going on. Congratulations. Your rambling is excellent. I think I'm going to lose the foul control. Is he doing all the shitting? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've been waiting for you. LB army like you're up for a fight. Are we not gonna address that there was a shadow person? I we yeah, and a brain <laughs> But he was a person I wonder if there, it's just a, this is like a throwback to Ninja Turtles Ha huh, it, it might be there's so many yeah. like Easter egg references to other shit. We have a poster from like Star Wars basically This sounds like a huge wind-up that is going to go bad. Okay. This is wow. Uh, this is like Fast and the Furious, where like it's going through the engine. Family. <laughs> <laughs> I live one quarter of a mile at a time. <laughs> That's what he says, right? I live, I live life a quarter, qu qu quarter mile <laughs> at a time. I don't know. You say, oh, you and your what, trees. What does it say? I live life one quarter mile at a time. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I saw the new one. You did? Yeah. I did too. Oh, I was going to tell you, I saw uh, Vacation Friends with Joss Cena. Have you seen that on Hulu? Vacation Friends? Yeah, it's John Cena and this blonde girl, and they're like, he's like an ex-army. <laughs> no, he's I haven't seen it. You haven't seen it? No. Oh, Wait, man. What's this? Yep, pretty anticlimactic. Oh, now you're going to fight the shadow. Oh. So we literally just spent two minutes of a fucking video for this. That was stupid. Now it's the guy. It's there he is. Loud too. Let me... Son of a bitch! Fucking snatcher! I had him! Dance with me, Travis. A katana. This is getting interesting. I'm gonna what fight this guy? By? Henry. Henry? <laughs> Your instincts serve you well. I. Am... I don't know who you are or what you mm. want, Sir Henry. Where are your manners? Wait, what? That was <laughs> Scottish? Boy. It's because of the accent of the guy. Shall we oh. get this over with? And oh, I didn't know he had an accent. Had dirty. Fine by me. After you. Maybe he's Irish, maybe? I don't know. Irish That's Scottish. why he did, like, the accent. I always get them confused. They all kind of sound the same. We didn't do anything, though. You won. You did it. You got those monies. But am I rank five? Yeah. I didn't have a fight. Wait. Travis, you are now ranked fifth. But we haven't even. We're just getting started. Perhaps you've forgotten these fights are an official game. If your opponent dies for whatever reason, according to the rules of conduct, it is your win. That's fucked up. That's the <laughs> stupidest rule I've ever heard. This guy's mine, and you just want me to let him go, bitch? <gasps> mm. Oh, that's not very PC. Yeah. Rules are rules. You can't have what you can't have. Whatever. But this dude says he wants to fight, and ain't nobody gonna stop him. This ass clown right here is... Who? Hey! He's gone! Mr. Sir Henry motherfucker, he just jacked... <laughs> what a <laughs> Sorry, that aggression for your next match. Sir Henry motherfucker. Who the hell was that guy?
Well, she knows. She called the fight just before they engaged. You did it. Yay. Yay best fight ever. Wow. That was probably the best one the whole game. So less than five minutes. Yeah. Yeah. I like it. I forgot what we were talking about. This is so stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, vacation friends, John oh, Cena. Yeah, yeah, I haven't seen it. Oh my gosh! I'll yeah. put it tonight. Yeah, no. no I am a super big fan, of John Cena. I don't know why too. you like The Rock so much. No, fuck you. That yeah. was the other way around. No. no, I said I don't like The Rock, and I said I prefer John Cena as an actor. No, we'll go back and play that video, okay, Stefano. Sure, show, but it's gonna. But show. no, it's me. No. I am the one who's at this Dude, John Cena side. So funny in He's Vacation great. Friends. He's great. Uh, in this, the, fucking in the Fast and the Furious movies, I think he was more entertaining than most of the characters. Oh yeah, and um, God, that was a terrible. They went to space in a Hi, yeah, monster in a car, or something yeah. stupid. <laughs> Joe is gay. That's a dumb title. <laughs> they didn't even think about that. Yeah. Registration is complete. As of today, you are officially the fifth ranked assassin in the United States. You see, United States. Mm. You are on the fast track to the top. Keep it up and good luck. But, um. No, it was a super funny movie. It blew my mind how funny it was. What other movie he was? Uh, uh, Suicide Squad. He was in Suicide Squad. Yeah, that was kind of good. It was alright. I liked it. I, I preferred like, it to the first one. I didn't. I don't know. I just. I can't. I don't like Suicide Squad. It's, it, just in general. Suicide Squad. Squad and in general. <laughs> yeah. They're just. I don't know. I mean, I prefer it because there's less Market Robbie, <laughs> <laughs> and I really don't like her as the um, uh, Harley Quinn thing. Really? Yeah. It's not very. Actually, in this movie, it was the most Harley Quinn she ever played. Because mm. in the first Suicide Squad, it didn't feel like Harley Quinn. It just feel like a character that looks like her, but does not behave like her at all. Like, mm. like I'm not saying that Margaret Robbie is a bad actress. I'm saying that the character is very bad fleshed out. Fleshed out. Oh, okay, okay. So, it's, it's just not a good character. And then on Birds of Prey, ugh, horrible movie. Oh, it's yeah. It's just bad. And I know what they were trying to go for, like a, like what kind of storyline, but it's still horrible. So, God, I would have been better if her and if she fought one uh, Wonder Woman and Wonder Woman two. That would right, that would be awesome. Awesome movie. That's actually like on. Um, there's a video game of the Suicides coming out. That is a Suicide Squad kills the Justice League, oh. where Superman is the bad guy. Uh, I'll show you the video. Oh. There's a there's a trailer for it. Um, but yeah, no, it's uh, <laughs> it's had like a shitty Star Wars. Yeah, thing. that's the trailer, that Star yeah, Wars thing. Yeah. I told you, which this looks very foreshadowing because that guy looks like Kylo Ren. He and does. This was an out when that was a thing. Wow. Uh, shut up, dog. The what is it called? Inquisitor in the Inquisitor story. Yeah. The third story. The Super, third story. Super something. The third story. Um. Did you return the, the dirty video? Is that what you're doing? No, I was buying a new video that is going to give me a technique. But. Yeah, he just totally blew my mind. A vacation friend. It was a good movie. Really? Yeah. I'll check it out. Oh, that was um, good. Because uh, in Suicide Squad, he did pretty good too. Yeah, he's uh, way better vacation friends. He's getting better. Every movie, he's getting better and better. I, I think, like I told you, man, I think John Cena is better than people give him credit for. Yeah. Um. Ooh, ice cream. You want some ice cream? We should forward this episode to him. To cool. John Cena? <laughs> yeah. Just, just like, that, that, so now that this, you know we're licking your balls. This episode's name is Brown Nose and John Cena. <laughs> 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 Look at those arms. Now that he, he looks like he's going to explode at some point. Oh yeah. Like, uh, but uh, actually, there was this um, um, like there's um, there's this wrestler. His name is Seamus. Is this uh, Irish like guy, and he has a YouTube channel where he goes and trains with other WWE superstars and some athletic guys, just like you know people that have like their private gyms and whatnot. Mm -hmm. And John Cena has his private gym. And he made a movie in China, I think, at some point. 
uh, and I don't know if it was with Jackie Chan or not, but like uh, he fucking like when he trains when he does like reps, he counts them in Chinese. Really? Yeah, and I'm like, ugh. Yeah, okay, whatever. Gross. But he's like, like, e like idiotically flexible. Like uh, he was talking about how when he trained over there, they changed the entire way of how he does things. Really? And uh, yeah, I know that that they taught him. Uh, some shit and and uh, he got really into it and uh, like he can squ like he can do splits like you I, I wouldn't think John Cena can split you know what I mean yeah he's so big if you're but, but he mentioned how when he was in China he uh, he started doing more flexibility workout which usually makes you weaker for a while but he was like but yeah you after that while you get used to combining both and then you're back in whatever shape you want Wow. And um, he was showing uh, this Seamus guy, this machine that how it works is it's like a seat and yeah. you know, like you put your legs. Oh, you yeah. Like it. I seen it on that. Yeah. Yeah. It's a pretty good machine. They're expensive. Yeah. But I was like, damn, man, uh, I would kind of want to try that shit and like, learn how. Like, I'm, I'm pretty close to like knowing how to like being able to do squats. Squats? But, I hope uh, so. Not squats, but um, <laughs> splits. Uh, uh, yeah. So what's the point in doing the splits? It's actually pretty good in terms of like the more flexible you are, it it can be better for your joints in the long uh, in the long term. Really? Yeah, because uh, when you're working out, you put a lot of tension to your tendons and ligaments and stuff like that because your muscles start to pull on them. Mm. So doing flexibility workout uh, allows you to give it like like that elasticity it's supposed to have and it gives you a better conditioning for your joints mm -hmm. overall and um, so it's not saying like oh making the splits it's healthy per se but having flexibility workouts that tend to lead to splits are good for you ah, I see uh, and it help you because a lot of people tend to have problems with their hips and shit like that yeah so yeah so like three dudes that I work with uh, that has um hip surgery or knee surgeries or yeah. shoulder surgeries it's always it's, those it's all about flexibility workouts a yeah. lot of times it's a, it's all about keeping that shit a lot of people that do like um i know that a lot of military people and all those that have carry heavy backpacks and all that mm -hmm. shit part of the problems is like lower backs and a lot of that stuff potentially could have been prevented by doing like certain types of yoga and stuff like that mm -hmm. but these are people that never think about oh i'm gonna do yoga <laughs> you know yeah what I mean? especially in the military no but, um it's yeah. just running and push-ups and sit-ups yeah push -ups. which it's horrible and not that great of a workout oh running's awful yeah it's the worst thing in the world let's see if she has anything new for me in the sword but let's uh next episode let's start the other mission all right so all those john cena fans <laughs>